Hey guys, my name is Lainey and I go by Lainey Fire on the internet and welcome to or back to my YouTube channel. So today I thought it'd be fun if we gave the Bear Sisters a makeover. I'm gonna start a stay file giving all of the in-game townies a makeover and I think I'm gonna start with them. But first of all, I do want to say that this isn't the best way to make them, it's just how I'd make them in my game. And second of all, I will tweak their appearance just a little bit, not just give them a completely different, just completely change their everything, but I will tweak them a little bit to my liking. So with that, let's just jump right in. So I think I'm going to start with Candy. I used, my first expansion pack was Get Together, and I remember take, seeing Candy for the first time and thinking she's like so freaking cool. I'm really excited to give her a makeover. So. First off the bat, my first tweak <laughs> is her waist. I don't think that's a realistic waist. I mean, prove me wrong, but I don't think people's waists can be that thin. So I am gonna stretch it out just a little bit. And I'm gonna change her eyebrows now. I am gonna make them dark, or like the true black rather than the blue black. So yeah. And second of all, let me find a good eyebrow. I could go for my favorites, like that. Or I could go for like a more realistic eyebrow too, or these. Ooh, these fit her eyebrows very well. I think they kind of look like her old ones too. So I think I'm gonna go for these. Next is, I think I'm gonna tweak her a little bit. I'm gonna, oh no, I'm gonna stretch her lips out a little bit maybe to here maybe widen her nose pull it down and widen it and I love her ears really I love how big her ears are I just think big ears are so cute so I'm not gonna change that I like her side profile so I think that's the only things I'm actually gonna change on her for now and we'll go to skin details I'm pretty sure she has a monolid, so I need to be careful giving her a skin detail that doesn't have a monolid, or a lid. But a lot of them nowadays do have a monolid option like this one, so this is it usually, and then they have a monolid option, which looks nice on her, but I'm not sure how much I actually like it on her, this one. I could go for the Symbian's one, because I'm pretty sure it has a monolid option. This one's pretty on her. I could go for that one or, oh, that one has a, that one's really pretty on her, but it has a upper eyelid and I don't think they have one without an upper eyelid. Yeah, they don't. I think I'm gonna go for this Symbian's one that I saw. It's this one, which looks really nice on her. So I'm gonna go for this one. I think I'm gonna give her eyelashes in a different layer, not these. I'm gonna give her her eyelashes and glasses instead. She also has very pink cheeks, so I might give her her pink cheeks in this layer instead. She has no freckles, which is sad. So I could give her this boo-boo blush, and just give her just pink, or I could give her, I mean, I, or I could just give her the shine for now and then go into cheek scars and give her more blush. Not enough. Like something like that. I kind of like that. So we'll go for cheek scars and blush for her. And then I will go for here. I will go for this GS skin overlay right here just for some texture and stuff. So this is what I have so far. I think she's looking really cute so far. Maybe the pink might be too much. Here, let me see if I can tone it down a little. Maybe this one instead. Yeah, that looks nicer. So, wait, what is Yuki's actual makeup? Because I don't want- oh! They have pretty similar makeup, it's just her- I think her lip gloss- she has a lip gloss instead of bright pink lipstick. But I don't think I'll go so heavy on Yuki's makeup because she's a teen. I don't usually give my teenagers too heavy of makeup. So maybe I'll just give all of the crazy makeup to Candy. Now I'll go into makeup for eyes. I don't know what eyes. I actually went through my eyes again. 
and got rid of some of my eyes that I had. But let's find the one. I like the 100s, but I don't know if I want to go for them. It's pretty realistic. I don't know if I want to go realistic or if I want to go more just regular. I also don't want to go for black with her. She has really dark eyes, but I don't want to go too dark. I kind of like these G27s on her. Yeah, I like the G27s on her. So I have that so far. Now I usually go for, what do I do next? We'll do hair. So she has um, she has platinum blonde to pink ombre. So I'm gonna try and do that as best as I can. I know Nexus Match hairs have that. So I have this one that has like accessories and then once you go down, there's like so many, like right here, so many ombre options. So I don't think I'll have a hard time choosing something. It's just choosing what really. I do want to give her headphones though. Maybe I'll have to find something that has headphones too. And I think I know what hair I want to give her. I just have it in my brain which one I want to give her. Let me see if I can find it real quick. It's this one by Okri. I think that's how you say it. But I just like how it looks. I think it just looks really nice on her. It frames her face really well and it does have an ombre option so that's good. Oh it's this one. We could do this pink. Ooh, I really like it. It kind of reminds me of like a better version of her hair, like what it was supposed to look like. I like that it has a fringe and it's pretty like flowy and stuff because if you see her before, I feel like it's kind of what it wanted to be, but it just didn't get there, if that makes any sense. So I just like the way it looks on her. So I'm gonna keep this hair and Oh, she's naked without her eyebrows, or wow. she's She needs her glasses. I might go for a Kajiko one, or no, these. Let's see which ones fit her the best. I think it really depends on what eye makeup I'm gonna go for for her. I think I'm gonna go something similar to what she had in her original design, like the big flick, some black around it and stuff, and maybe bright pink lipstick, but I just don't know yet, so I'm, I think I'm gonna go for one of these for now. Maybe this, actually I haven't seen this yet. I think I'm gonna go for one of these for now. And if I need something bigger so you can see it, I'll go for that later. So we'll go for those. And I go for outfit next. So I'm gonna go some similar to her outfit, but I'm not gonna completely copy it if that makes any sense like it's cool fine but it's not great if that makes any sense like i might try and find like a jacket with a tank top under but i'm not going to completely limit myself to that if that makes any sense what would like somebody who is a dj wear that's the question i need something that's off of her hands she's like doing the dj booth thing so you don't really want it covering her hands so while she does the dj stuff so I could go for something like a tank top and put something over it or oh I could do this it's kind of similar and then I think it has other options like this probably not I could go for this kind of thing too I told myself I wasn't gonna try and copy it but at the same time I kind of want to do something similar I'm just indecisive oh I think I know what I want to put on her I need to find it first but I also need to put this on her just because it's see-through. It's this, it's this thing. I just think it's so cool. It's just two colors. You can have a lot of different varieties and stuff. What's her original colors that she had? Maybe we can copy them. So it's like blue and orange and black. So I'm, I think I could give her a blue, like a blue and orange one maybe if I have one I have this that's blue kind of blue and orange which is kind of cool I kind of like that actually this blue just like it's a nod to the thing even though it looks nothing like it and we can change this to a different color 
Maybe, what's a good color? I think I'm gonna go for the black, just because it's blue, orange, and black, which is her colors. And I told myself I was gonna give her short sleeves because you wouldn't wanna get her sleeves in the DJ like stuff, you know, falls over her hands. But I think it's close enough to her wrists that it, and it's skin tight enough that it wouldn't do that necessarily. So I think we're good with that. Now pants. She's probably a dancer as well. So we'll have to have something that doesn't necessarily get in the way while she dances. Like that, we can't really use that because it looks like it could get in the way. Plus it clips a little. We could give her some just regular pants or I could give her a skirt. We could give her something like this, but then a, like a cool pattern like that. Or maybe this pattern. I think that matches her top too much. I could give her like this overall thing. Probably not. I could give her something low rise like this, but it'd probably get in the way of her dancing. Or that, maybe? So maybe something like this. I know it might get in the way of her dancing, but maybe just in a black, like that. Yeah, I kind of like that actually. And she has some high tops. I could use some big boots. I love these boots but in the base game. They're my favorite. So much CC, but my favorite boots are base game. <laughs> I'll go for these Shake Productions ones, but I think I might go for maybe a blue or an orange. Just so you can see them like that. We'll go for that. And now nails. I don't want to go too long so she can't do her job as a DJ. So I will give her just some small ones. I do red or I'll do red. I like the red. Now makeup kind of makeup. I could go for kind of like a this thing. It's kind of like her original design. Or I could go for really like her original design. But I think I like this one. Just, just a very smoky eye. Let's see what her original design was. Her original design has like a big flick and then some black eyeshadow just smudged around it. So I don't think I'm gonna do that very much. Oh, she already looks so much better. So, or I could just do this kind of thing. I think I'm gonna do eyeshadow first. I'm, I think I could do maybe like this kind of thing. Oh no, it gives her an upper eyelid. I don't wanna do that. Yeah, it gives her an upper eyelid. I don't want to do that. We could go pink still. Like maybe with that. Does that give an upper eyelid? I don't think so. Kind of like how that looks. And then maybe just a regular wing. I want to keep her having a mono lid. So I need to be careful with what I choose. Or that. Oh, that's pretty. It just is a little glossy. Yeah, I like that. Do they have a pinky? Oh, that is the pink version. So yeah, we'll go for this one. And eyeliner. I don't know if I'm going to go huge on the eyeliner or even do the smoky. Actually, I kind of like the smoky eye with that eyeliner. Or with the eyeshadow. I think I'm going to go for that. And I don't know if I want to go pinker for her cheeks or anything. But I think I like how it looks how her design looks right now. I don't think she needs any pinker cheeks, even though she had bright pink cheeks beforehand. But I could go kind of in this direction. Definitely not that color, but in this direction. She had bright pink lips before. This gives her bright pink lips too. Or maybe I can find one that suits her skin tone better. Maybe this one. I think that suits her skin tone a lot better. Or I could go for something like this, which looks pretty good too, like this pink color. I kind of like it actually. I don't know, but it doesn't look like it matches her makeup that much. Or this, and like a pinker color, 
like that. Oh, I like that a lot. I think I'm gonna go for this. And I might make her cheeks a little more pink. Or is that too much? No, I like that. And we need to give her her, we need to give her her um, uh, headphones right here. What color? We need to give her these rose gold ones. Or is that too much? Right there, it has silver everywhere. So I might give her the silver ones. And I don't know why, but I feel like she suits gauges. I don't know why. Where are the gauges that I like? They're from Snowy, not Snowy Escape. It's from Eco Lifestyle. If I can find them, which are these. I feel like she suits gauges. So I'll give her the gauges. And I think our candy's done. Oh, I think I, she looks so cool. I like how she turned out. So as a reminder, we have candy before and candy after. Wow, I, that's a big difference. And I don't think it's cause I even um, edited her a little. I just think it's just a huge difference. She looks so much better. So now it's time for Yuki. So I read up on them a little bit and Yuki wants to be just like her older sister Candy, but she, but she's more in the computers, I think. I like her design as well, but I just think she doesn't really look like a teenager. She looks a lot like her sister, which is kind of okay, cause they're, you know, sisters. But since I edited her sister, she doesn't look that much like her anymore, so I think I'm gonna do the same edits that I did to her. So I made her mouth a little wider, maybe not that much wider, like that, and then I made her nose a little bigger and pulled it down like that. So that's what I did with Candy, and I didn't mess with her, her side profile at all, at all, so I will keep that as well. Now time for... I think I'm gonna do similar skin details to her sister, but first I want to give her her eyebrows. I can't give her the same eyebrows, but I can give her similar ones, like maybe like this or that, maybe not that. This is what her sister had, so I might go for these. They just make her look sweet and I like it. She looks a little sad. I have a weird thing where a lot of the times my sims just end up looking sad. It's really weird. So I will go for these. I think she looks less sad now. And I'm gonna do similar skin details, probably the same one that her sister has, maybe this one, just so they look sim uh, like sisters. So let's see, do they look similar? I can't tell. So this is Candy and Yuki. Yeah, I think I will keep the keep them similar in skin details wise. So with Yuki, she's a hacker. So I kind of think she'd be someone who'd stay up all night. So maybe she has eye bags under her eyes. So, but first I might give her, no, I think I'm gonna do the same thing with um, her sister and give her her eyelashes and glasses instead. Or should I give her glasses? That's the question. I think I'm gonna give her glasses, so I'm gonna give her her eyelashes in here because I think I'm gonna give her glasses. Don't need to be too big, so maybe these. Because I'm also not gonna give her too much makeup too because I don't you normally give my teenage sims too much makeup even though her design has a lot of makeup, so. I'm also gonna give her eye bags because in my head she's a hacker, maybe she stays up all night. Maybe not that much of an eye bag. Maybe a little less. Oh no. Maybe I'll give her eye bags in here. Like this kind of eye bag. I don't know if I like it or not. Oh, maybe that kind. Just to make it a little more prominent, but not too much. So like before and after. Yeah, I like that. And probably the rest is the same. Okay, so I'm back 
but I think I'm not gonna do as heavy as as heavy as blush like I did on candy either so I might instead of going only I think I did three like the third one to the end instead of doing that I might just go for the second one just give her more blush than I usually give my sims but not as much as her sister now hair no eyes actually so for eyes I might give her something similar her eyes are a lot lighter than her sisters oh that's pretty so her eyes are lighter than her sisters by like a shade I think yeah it's by a shade candy has um, the first one and she has this one but I kind of like the one I kind of like that one on her it's the first one I pressed but I really do like it yeah I like this one so I'm gonna keep this one it's the Gopal's Me Eyes G26 I think they look really nice on her now hair I don't think I'm gonna give her an ombre like I did her sister but who knows maybe if I could give her an ombre I will like maybe something black to teal or something I think that'd be cool if I find one that I like Candies was kind of necessary just for her design but Yuki we can pretty much do whatever we want I mean I kind of want to keep it similar but I don't want to keep it exactly the same I think it's funny, I've, I've kind of been like in and out, kind of like, I want them to look the same, I want them to look similar, oh I can do whatever I want if that makes any sense. This one's kind of fun, I kind of like this on her, but it has this line right here, if you can see it, so I don't really like it. Or I could go for this type of hair, it's one of my favorite hairs, but that means I can't use it on someone else. But I think it looks really cute. It kind of looks like kind of shaggy. Like I know it had it gives her bangs, but kind of reminds me like the same vibe as her old hair. But I'll still look a little longer. I don't want to pick the first thing and then there's something else out there that looks better. Oh, I know exactly what hair I want to give her. It's on the top of my head and it is one of these i think it's this one <gasps> or this oh that one's pretty maybe this one it doesn't look like her other hair at all but i really like how it looks on her so i think i'm gonna go for this hair then maybe stretch her lips out a little more yeah so i'm gonna go for this hair now outfit I kind of like the blue, red, and then these shoes. So I'm gonna go for something similar, but not necessarily the same thing. We'll go for, or this. What's something a hacker would wear? I don't know, I don't know any hackers. <laughs> oh, I can give her some more this kind of stuff. Like maybe she likes, no, she, she is a geek, so don't really know what a geek wears. <laughs> I mean, I'm a geek, so I know what I wear, but... Or this kind of thing? Laney, you can't use this on everyone. This is your favorite jacket, but you can't use it on everyone. What is hackery? I don't know what a hacker wears. Maybe she wears something like this? Or something like this? No. What do teenagers wear? Maybe she wears a jacket? Like this? That one looks nice. What are her colors again? A teal matching her hair. I could give her something like this. Or this, actually. And then maybe I can give her high-waisted jeans so it's not too much stomach. Let's see, what are their color? Oh, they have other boring colors. I really like that on her. I think it kind of matches her vibe but I don't know just yet. Maybe something like that. Ooh, I kind of like that. Do they have like a, come on. Oh yeah, I kind of like the orange on her. Is that hackery? I think it might be. I'll come back to that as well. I know I have so much custom content, but I, at, at the same time, I'm like, I have none. I can't find what I'm looking for. 
I don't know what I'm looking for, but I feel like I can't find it. I like that so much. I'm gonna go for this. Even if it's not her vibe, I just like it. For these? That's cool. Maybe in red, just to go off of, definitely not red. But I kinda like the way these look. This looks a fit. No, I like this. But is that her vibe? Oh my gosh. Or this kind of thing? This kind of thing is nice. I might go for this, actually. So she has like a teal, like that. Maybe we'll go for this. So her shirt, remind me, is teal and green. And then she has yellow and orange headphones. I feel like we already have too much teal with her hair. So I might go orange and maybe like an orange color or yellow. Ooh, I like the yellow. And then since she's a hacker, I think I'm gonna go for this. And since she's a hacker, I'm gonna have her short, have short nails because you kind of need short nails so it's easier for you to use the keyboard and stuff. But I might give her some chipped nail polish. I don't know why, I just feel like she suits chipped. And I think we're almost done with her. I think we're done with her outfit. So makeup, I already have her eyes and she has similar makeup to her sister. So I might give a, her a little, even though I don't normally give my teens that much makeup. I might give her just a little flick. And then maybe, you can't even see it with her hair, but I'll give her a little flick and maybe just some shine on her eyes like that. Maybe just some shine on her eyes like that. Maybe some orange. Kind of like the white on her. Maybe, or just nothing. I don't want anything too much. I kind of like this on her, this. Yeah, I like that. And then some either either similar to what I mean I could give her this kind of thing but I want it to be cute like maybe kind of like the orange on her is that cute or is that bad oh I said I was gonna give her glasses too I forgot about that Cute. Oh, I like that a lot. I'm gonna go for this. And glasses. I don't think she wears glasses, but I just wanna give her glasses. No, she doesn't suit glasses very much. I mean, I can try other ones, but, but I don't think she suits them that much. So I think our Yuki's done too. No, she doesn't have earrings on. I don't think I'm gonna- I'm not gonna give her gauges or anything like her sister, but I am gonna give her- you know what? Maybe a nose piercing would be cute. Maybe not a septum, but a, just a little tiny nose piercing. Here, right here. We'll just give her a little stud, and then I'm gonna give her just some earrings. Maybe just a couple. We don't need anything too much, like maybe like that. And one last thing. I'm gonna give her- little cowlick i don't know why but i just think she suits a cowlick just a little maybe this one just so it's little but not too big and with that i think yuki's done i think she turned out so cute i don't know if she's like a hacker or nerd loner look like that i don't really know what those people look like but i really think i like how she looks so here's candy before. And candy after. Here's Yuki before. And here's Yuki after. So yeah, 
I think I'm done. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe. Tell me how you think I did and who should I do next. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.